since participation is so fashionable now, just now, I always say it's like the liturgy of a new religion and that new religion is what we call culture. To work on participation is to work on its real meaning and somehow to deconstruct all the possible falsifications of its uh, uh, spiritual meaning. I mean that we used to uh, consider participation a sort of achievement in itself, but we consider participation a mean to achieve something. Participation is not a, it's not a value in itself, uh, and on, the, on the contrary, it's quite a delicate protocol and it's very easy to make a very bad use of that protocol. That's why in our pieces uh, people are, let's say, uh, invited to reflect through action on the meaning of participation in itself uh, and not just to obtain a sort of uh, um, enthusiasm about it, uh, not to make a regression to childhood, let's say. Et aussi ce qu'il y a dans la participation, c'est que normalement la participation est utilisée pour la légitimation d'institutions qui ne sont plus légitimes, qui sont en question. C'est intéressant de se rendre compte comme aujourd'hui, quand les institutions sont très mises en cause par les habitants européens, tout à coup, la participation devient la grande nouvelle politique des institutions culturelles euh, dans toute l'Europe. Et je crois que nous qui travaillons dans le théâtre, nous devons être très attentifs à cette politique et ne pas jouer et chanter la même chanson qui est dictée. They always think that participation is positive in itself. We could even say that it's an expression of the, the age of positivity and the, the age of positive thinking. And somehow I think that our work is about uh, uh, making a negative treatment of it, which doesn't mean to treat uh, negatively the participation, but to find in which way it could be transformed into something negative. La participation a depuis longtemps été surévaluée quand, quand le temps des votations est arrivé, ce qui est bien en soi, c'est avoir des grands taux de participation. Quand le spectacle est arrivé, ce qui est bien en soi, c'est avoir des grands taux d'occupation de la salle, de participation des spectateurs qui viennent acheter leur, leur, leurs, leurs entrées. Mais il faudrait se demander si participer à quoi et pour euh, avoir quoi en échange. I think there is a link, a thematic link between all that uh, cultural tenderness about participation and uh, the, the actual structure of management of uh, the power, simply because participation is the living form of consensus of consentment somehow when we are doing something together and we are in a dispositive and we are obeying the dispositive uh, uh, without even thinking about it we are actually repeating what we eventually do each day on our life uh, in the system we are living in and that's why that's why I'm so critical towards uh, the um, positivity of participation in itself because actually in my opinion is in my opinion is like the big big enactment the liturgy of uh, consentment of obedience let's say. and when you transform politics into religion politics are no more politics and it's quite easy that from that hybridation of things you 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 obtain something very 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 bad Totalitarianism is but a religious version of politics. And culture, I mean, culture becomes the mediator of that osmosis, of that fusion, is that there is something pathological in the idea of culture, something um, instrumental, instrumentalizing, let's say.